Um, so I feel like I'm supposed to take one of these. I'm not sure why, what the energy is going to give us for the daily spill for Patreon. Patron extended. Okay, chop wood. You've got something that needs your attention ASAP. It needs for you to take care of something. Number 42, it's time to get busy. So what do you need to get busy with? Is there some spring cleaning you need to do? Is there some um, cleaning out the clutter, cleaning out your space that you need to do, making room for something new? Think about it. Okay, let's see. Hmm. Patron Daily Spill. Is this about cleaning out the cup clutter for something new? Healing? Oh yeah, when you heal, you clean out the clutter. You've got an opportunity that's going to be arising in front of you. So that clutter may be within you. And you need to heal it and let it go. This weekend is an awesome time for that because we've got that magnificent moon. So yes, do some healing. Do some releasing. Do some letting go. You know, do some looking at things from a different aspect and really just allow and release. Feel and release. Um, you've got an opportunity that is going to present itself. This is the Page of Pentacles. Something you can put your hands on. Something that may make things really change for you. But there is a need for you to really get to work. Get busy. Tell us about this new venture. Tell us about this. Security. This has to do with your security. Uh, may have to do with your money, with your um, abundance. Okay, we got the drama card out. I feel like you need to avoid drama at all costs. And this drama may come from within your family. Um, activities. At this time, activities may cause drama. So, you've got a new beginning that is looking you right in the face it's like and you may not even realize it now here's the thing you may have drama within some family activities keep positive because you're manifesting at this moment you are manifesting clear your space clear out the clutter within yourself do some meditations drink a lot of water you know really let the impurities come out of you um and really release what is, you know, may have been holding on to you. Or maybe you've been holding on to. And um, allow the healing to take place, you know, with the a a angel of the ocean. Just allow things to really balance out for yourself. This opportunity will show itself. It has to do with security. Um, it's a new beginning for you. You know, there could be a real change, but you need to to keep the drama on a low. This could, like I said, activity. It could have to do with family members. Tell me about the new beginning. Dang. Happiness, the sun. This new beginning can make you very happy. Very, very, very happy. Um, possibly you and someone else could be family, could be friends, could be um, someone else. Could be um, a love interest. Okay, tell me about the new beginning. Oh, yeah. That's reversed. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I'm sorry. If you have a... Okay, okay, okay. I'm having another reading coming to me. Okay, I did a reading. Look it up. Okay. It is a daily spill as well, but it is on YouTube. And the name will be something another around embrace the newness, uh, new beginning, um, destiny, and manifesting. Something like that. Because I'm going to tell you right now, I think the two are, and I just did it. So I think the two are coinciding together. Oh my goodness. I want you to look. This is a release of heartache. Saying bye-bye to the heartache. Bye-bye to the past. Bye-bye to the pain. Because you've got a wish. That's nine of cups. A wish coming true. A wish. A new beginning for you. 
destiny, destiny. Oh my goodness, options. Man. See, here's the thing. I feel like you've been looking at a lot through the moon, light of the moon, and it's caused illusions. You're giving up the illusions, I feel like. And what this is doing is this is leaving space for you to bring in something good. You're manifesting something good. Prosperity. It's, this is amazing. This has got such a good feel. Okay, now we're going to take some other cards because I, I do feel like you're manifesting. If you aren't, you need to be. Okay, manifestation. Okay, we've got two come out. And for some reason, they're wanting me to take a... Um, and so, uh, this is like um, past life. Yeah. So, show me. Okay. Okay, you may have been in a past life Indian or Native American. We've got the peace pipe and we've got the flowing river. So, I will tell you, you one thing that can be very beneficial for you is to listen to some Native American. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm getting the flute. I'm getting, the, because they have, um, on YouTube you can find loads. Okay, yes. I am getting also one that came to me. Um, this was, I can't remember when, but it was a time whenever I was really, I don't know, I was going through some things and, you know, I got on my YouTube and there it was. And it's the Cherokee water song. Um, this water flowing. It, and it's just something about the sound. It, it just brings me peace. It brings me peace. And um, a lot of the Native American music brings me peace. So I feel like that you need to be listening to. And, and they have meditations on there as well. Oh my goodness. That's, that's, that's got such a good feel to it. And look on the bottom. Medicine man, medicine woman. So I feel like in a past life you were definitely, definitely, um... Native American. Yeah. So, let's see what you've got here. You have got to, you've got, I forgive myself, and I am totally adequate for all situations. Let's go with I forgive myself. As I forgive myself, I leave behind all feelings of not being good enough. And I am free to love myself. That's beautiful. Then we have, I am totally adequate for all situations. I am one with the power and wisdom of the universe. I claim this power. And it is easy for me to stand up for myself. That is awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Now, if for those of you wanting romance, I'm going to take you um, a couple cards here. This this one here may fall in romance. It doesn't have to. I, I'll go ahead and tell you. It doesn't have to. Okay, can we have one? I'm getting spirit tingles for some reason. Oh, they're going to give us three. Hmm. Yeah, I've got spirit tingles. Not sure why. Oh, now I know why. Ha <laughs> ha. You got twin flame. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're going to start here with this one. Don't you look at it? It's like she's holding her heart. It's almost like she can feel. It's like feeling one another. Imagine all unwanted thoughts dissolving into light, creating room for new opportunities and possibilities for your life. Now, next. <laughs> Look at that beautiful card. Do you read that, Twin Flame? Twin Flames, your passion ignites. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Then we have this beauty, which is Sacred Union. Honor and treasure your relationship, for it is truly sacred. 
That is beautiful. So, I feel like for some of you, um, you know, you may have thought you were with your twin or, you know, you knew who your twin was. And when you release that energy and just allow, your real twin comes to you. The twin flame that, you know, is for real comes to you. This is beautiful. Okay. Our first one out is let go of control issues. Allow this situation to unfold naturally. And then we have stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. And yes, it will. This is amazing. This is really beautiful. So that's what I've got for you. I appreciate each and every one of you and the support that you give to the channel. Um, thank you so much. Much light and love. Bye.